So you might be in a situation where for some reason you're getting this type of pop-up on your particular iPhone, which is telling you that your you know, device couldn't connect to the server, there may be a problem with the server or network, some sort of pop-up like this on your particular iPhone. Now this happens to me sometimes, which is very annoying, but the first thing I'd recommend doing for the most part is to essentially go through inside of your settings application of your particular iPhone, go ahead and open it up, and what you're going to want to do here is you want to swipe down until you see something that says like iCloud or iCloud Drive or something like that. Now, this is probably not going to be in this panel. It's going to be in your name at the very top. And then you'll see iCloud. You want to go and tap on iCloud right here. And you basically just want to make sure iCloud has access to your particular you know, cell data and everything like that. So there should be a little panel. Here we go, access iCloud data on the web. You want to make sure this is on. What you can also do is under iCloud right up here. And what I'd recommend doing also under iCloud Drive right here, tapping onto this and just make sure you have this little toggle turned on. And that's basically the main thing you can do here. So go back into your files application. You want to open it back up. You want to go and see if you're getting that pop-up. If you're still getting that pop-up even after that, the next thing that a lot of people recommended doing was basically just going through and restarting your iPhone. So just going through, hold down the buttons you normally would to restart your device. So hold them down. Go ahead and slide the power off. And what you can do there is you can actually go through and see if that ends up fixing the problem. Power back on, and that might end up fixing the problem for you. That's exactly what I'd recommend doing. Now, if that still doesn't end up working for some reason, the other thing you can try doing for the most part is to actually go through and see if the iCloud servers are actually down. So you can do this by going to a website like downdetector.com or is it downrightnow.com, one of these types of websites. And if Apple servers are down or if iCloud is down or if it tells you iCloud is down, there's not really much you can do. You're basically, you're basically just going to have to wait it out until they end up fixing that problem. Now, you can also try updating your iPhone as well. So go back into your iPhone settings, scroll down to general, Go into software update, go and see if there's an update available. And if there is, I'd probably recommend updating your device. So that pretty much covers it up here. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.